Hello viewers, welcome to my channel and today's talk is uh, lymphadenoitis. Uh, lymphadenoitis is uh, the medical term uh, which is used to describe the enlargement in one or the more lymph nodes and uh, most of the time it's due to infection you know. And the lymph nodes are filled with white blood cells uh, that help your body to fight infections. Now when the lymph nodes become infected, it's usually an infection started uh, somewhere else in your body you know, and uh, rarely lymph nodes can enlarge due to cancer. Now you have about 600 lymph nodes in the body and uh, but normal lymph nodes may only be felt uh, uh, below the jaw, under the uh, your arms you know and uh, in the groins area or behind the ears you know or in the neck you know and uh, a normal lymph node is a small and firm and uh, when lymph nodes become infected they usually increase in size and become tender and uh, may be felt in other areas of your body during the physical examination you know and the infections that uh, spread to the lymph nodes are usually caused by bacteria or viruses or fungus you know and uh, it's important uh, to learn how the infection spreads in your lymph nodes so that the right treatment can be started you know now uh, lymphadenoitis uh, can be one of the two causes uh, number one is the localized lymph uh, lymphadenoitis and generalized lymphadenoitis you know now in the localized uh, lymphadenoitis uh, uh, it's uh, a common type and uh, it's localized uh, involves one or the uh, just few lymph nodes and uh, that are close to the area where the infection started you know and the examples are like uh, uh, lymph nodes enlarged because of a tonsil infection maybe felt in the neck area you know and uh, the generalized uh, lymphadenitis uh, uh, is the type of the lymph node infection that occurs in two or more lymph node groups and uh, may be caused by an infection that spreads through the bloodstream or the other illness that affects the whole body you know and uh, uh, it can be infection that can be enlarged due to bacterial vir uh, infection or viral infection or the fungal infection you know and uh, the main symptoms of the lymphadenoitis uh, is the enlargement of lymph nodes and uh, uh, symptoms caused by an infection lymph node an infected lymph node that may be uh, like uh, lymph nodes that increase in size you know and uh, that are painful when you touch and uh, that are soft and uh, met or the matted together you know redness or uh, the red sticking of the skin over the node uh, you know and uh, filled with pus you know and the fluid that drains from the uh, nodes to the skin you know so these are the common signs and the symptoms now your doctor will perform the physical examination and uh, if he suspects you know he may advise the further blood tests you know uh, uh, for the further evaluation and uh, just to find out the cause of the enlargement of the lymph nodes you know and uh, that may include like blood tests or taking a sample from the tissue you know uh, known as biopsy you know and, and see under the microscope you know so about uh, in presence of any cancer cells and uh, once diagnosed then the treatment depends on the cause you know and uh, uh, there will be uh, the treatment will be based on uh, how old the patient is you know and uh, overall health you know and uh, uh, about the what are the problems you know signs and symptoms you know and uh, uh, how long the uh, uh, that uh, condition uh, how did it start you know and uh, finally the diagnosis like if it's cancerous or non cancerous you know so your doctor will uh, decide the treatment option uh, after the evaluation uh, thank you very much for watching this video if you need more information about any disease any medical condition you can visit our website www.diseasesandtreatment.com and please do not forget to subscribe to this channel for more informative videos every day Thank you.